Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Coco. Today's 9 a.m. hit class. I'm Jen. Let's get started. Extend those arms out. Let's start wiggling. Relax through your neck and tops of shoulders as you open up your chest and your back. Build up that breath work. In through the nose, out through the mouth. As you exhale, activate your belly. Not out, in. All right, go ahead and change directions. Hopefully you're getting some good shoulder blade movement as the arms go in these circles this morning. All right, let's bring your arms to your side. Let's do some giant circles. All right, today's workout, we're gonna do a ladder format. So what that means is we have four rungs. Uh, well, not four rungs, four ladders that we're going to do. And we have six rungs of the ladder. And each rung represents a different movement that we're going to do. And we're going to climb down the ladder and climb back up the ladder. Okay. And at the top is for longer time. So we have a 60 second, 50 second, 40 second, and so on, all the way down to 10 seconds. Okay. Now, each ladder is going to be kind of sort of focus on a, a specific area. So our first ladder is going to be a cardio ladder. All right. And then we're going to have a lower body ladder, an upper body ladder, and a core ladder. All right. Um, now we'll climb down the ladder. That's three and a half minutes. I'll give you 30 seconds recovery and then we'll climb back up. So that gets us about to eight minutes per ladder. Okay. All right. Now, as I mentioned, this first one is upper body. So we're going to move between quickly between each guy. All right. So we have lateral shuffle jumps to start for 60 seconds. Okay. And then I will walk you through each one, tell you what's coming. It's all things that we know. Uh, hot feet, burpees, knee thrusts, jumping jack squats, and high knees. All right. So with that said, no dumbbells here, okay? Lateral shuffle, and I'm gonna take two lateral shuffles and then a jump. Okay, ready, steady, we're going for a minute. Let's go, lateral shuffle and jump. Shuffle, shuffle, jump. And as you shuffle, keep your knees separated and shoulders level. Nicely done. Twenty seconds. And then we go right into the next one. Hot feet. Keep the feet moving. Ball to your feet, heels are off the ground. Good. 15 seconds. Then we have burpees. Three, two, one. Forty seconds. Ten seconds. Nine. 
All right, then we have knee thrusts. Ready, let's go. 15 seconds. Switch. Then we have jumping jack squats. Let's go. And high knees. Two and one. Oh. I agree. All right. 10 more seconds. No, 15 seconds of recovery. And then we're working our way back up at your pace. Starting with high knees for 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Jumping jack squat. Ten more seconds. Knee thrusts. And switch. Good. 40 seconds of burpees. Ready? Let's go. All right, hot feet. Thirty more seconds. All right, lateral shuffle jump. Let's go. Good work. 30 more seconds and we are done with cardio.
and time. I know that's really terrible. All right, next up is lower body. <laughs> All right, good. Eight minutes up, let's get rolling. Now we need dumbbells. Starting off with a split stance hinge, then we'll do side kicks. Then we have lateral lunge to curtsy. High plank, single leg raise, dumbbell jump squats. Thank gosh, that's only 20 seconds. And then over overs for 10. All right, so split stance hinge, get your dumbbells and get into your split stance. Ready? Loading that front leg, let's go. Driving off that front hamstring. Good, switch legs. All right, next one is side kicks. We'll spend 25 seconds on each leg. All right, ready? Let's go. Good, 10 more seconds. Heel and snap, knee and snap. And switch. Good, lateral lunge to curtsy, ready. I'm gonna spend 20 seconds on the one leg and then switch. Okay, switch. Okay, last one and we're down in a high plank. Single leg lift. Pull the leg up using your hamstring. Body's in a tight high plank. And switch. All right, excellent. Dumbbell jump squats. And over overs. and time. Whew. Good. How's that heart rate? Thirty seconds recovery in through your nose, out through your mouth. 
All right, over, overs, jump squats, high plank. Okay, ready, let's go. Over the big dog. Stabilize your torso, exhale, jump squats. High plank. And switch. Now we're up for when we finish this in five side kicks, two and one. And side kicks for 40. Oh. That's all right. And switch. And then it's lateral lunge to curtsy for 50. Three, two, and one. Lateral lunge to curtsy. Use your breath. All right, switch sides. All right, reach for those dumbbells. Split stance hinges. Neutral spine. Good. Exhale, push yourself up. Last one, switch legs. Good work, 10 seconds. Last one. All right, nicely done. All right, we cover here while we talk about what's coming next. All right, we have eccentric push-ups for a minute. Split stance row to press row to press, right? Alternating bicep curls, kneeling clean to press, crab toe touch, and eye to tease. So eye to tease is here. Okay, and that's why we're only doing it for 10 seconds because that is tough work. All right. All right, setting the timer. Okay, eccentric push ups. Get down into your high plank, lowering yourself to the ground with control. All right, yes, yay! 60 seconds of practice. 
why don't I ever get to practice my push-ups? Here we go, lower with to the ground with control. And back up. It's not about quantity, it's about quality. And let yourself get back up however you need to. Just slow the ride down. You wanna activate through your chest, through your back, through your triceps. All these great things you get to think about. Through your belly, I almost forgot. Almost done, kids. All right, nicely done. What's up next? Split stance, row to press. All right, 50 seconds. Row to press. Good. And switch. Row and press. Good. Last one. All right, reach for the dumbbells, alternating bicep curl. Nice and slow. Only 40 seconds, you got it. And then we'll be down on the ground for clean to press. Good, 10 more seconds, keep those elbows still. And down to the ground, clean to press for 30. Ready, gorilla, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, dumbbells down, crab toe touch for 20. And if you find this is too tricky, just hold your reverse tabletop. You can do a leg kick if you want. All right, eye to tease, ready. Two and three. Oh. All right. Ida T's are terrible. They only go to here. Um, you can do palm up or palm down. I have a hard time doing um, I end up being palms together and then twist palms down. All right, so here we are starting at the top. Ready. I to tease. Last one. All right, crab toe touch. Go ahead, and then we have kneeling clean to press. All right, kneeling clean to press. Let's go for 30. Zip at the top, don't arch your back. Use that exhale, engage your core.
Last one. Alternating bicep curl. I got a good sweat going. <laughs> Almost there. All right, split stance, row to press. Row, twist, and press to the ceiling. Last one and we'll switch sides. Row, twist and press. Good work. Eccentric push-ups. All right, stay with me. We're gonna lower ourselves to the ground, an inch from the ground, hold. Three, two, one, and down. Okay, ready? Slowly going down. Three, two, one. Lower. Three, two, and one. Three, two, and one. Three, two, one. Lower, lower, lower. Three, two, 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 and one. All right. <laughs> and we're done. All right, we get our 30 seconds off. Now we're just on core. Yeah. <sighs> All right. So we have inchworms, jackknives, bicycle, plank, scissor kick, and Superman hold. So Superman hold, we're gonna be face down, floating everything. We're just gonna rest on the ground between our sternum and our hip pointers. Everything else is floated up. Okay. Make sure you have pair of socks for your jackknives to pass from hand to hand. There you go. Okay. All right, you ready for inchworms? Inchworms for 60 and then jackknives for 50. So inchworms were articulating. So remember, allow yourself to enjoy that as much as you can. And I'm not gonna walk, I'm just gonna walk in and walk out. I'm not gonna travel. All right, standing in front. Start melting down to the ground. Walk yourself out and push yourself back in. Now the goal is, right, as you go out, you're sliding, activating from armpit to hip. And you're not wobbling. You're in the narrowest of trenches or tunnels, right? So you're not gonna let, oh, that's 60 seconds. Okay, jackknife, here we go. Keep your legs as straight as you can. Exhale to draw them up. Use those exhales. <sighs> 
stay with it. 10 seconds. Okay, yoga block down. Palms at your ears. Ready bicycles and go. This is just 40 seconds. Thirty seconds. Twenty seconds. Ten seconds. Roll over, it's plank time. Okay, after plank is scissor kick. Lift that transverse, zip the rib cage, wrists under armpits. All right, scissors, flip back over. Adduction and abduction. Two and one, roll over and float everything off the ground and hold. It's kind of like Mission Impossible right here, right? Nah, nah. And down. Whew. All right, we get 30 seconds and we get to start from the bottom and work our way up. I'm trying to think what was terrible. Oh, I know it was terrible. I miscounted inchworms and so I had to load it all into jackknives. <laughs> yes, you got extra jackknife work. You're welcome. <laughs> I totally spaced out and I did 30 seconds of inchworm instead of a minute. So we got to do like a minute 20 for jackknives, which is awesome. Oh, see, you guys made me laugh and then I lost track of my time here. So now we get a start right now. Ready? Superman hold. Let's go. Roll over. Scissor kicks. You can just keep that in your head throughout the rest of this ladder. You are welcome. Five, four, three, two, one, plank. Da -na -na. Da -na -na. Da -na -na. I don't know about you, but that actually kind of pimped me up a little bit. <laughs> I was feeling a little bit tired, but I can do this. All right, after 10 seconds here, then we have 40 seconds of bicycle. <sighs> Three, two, one, let's go. Bicycle. Holy moly. 20 seconds. Oh my goodness. Holy shnikey. I'm getting a good burn. Okay, jackknives for 50. Oh, 
Putin on my legs were so heavy. Ten seconds, breathe through it. All right, inchworms. Let's go. 60 seconds of inchworms. I promise I cannot mess this up. Last one. And time. Woo. All right. Standing extra wide, soft bend in the knees, arms extended, hinge and toe touch. Use that exhale, soften through the hamstrings. Slow it down, hang out there for a minute if you need to. If your heart rate is going fast, use this as a way to help slow down your breathing. Slow down your heart rate, exhale as you go down. Inhale as you rise. All right, nicely done, okay. Now I'm gonna be totally unorthodox here, getting into our pigeon. We're gonna go into a split stance. Frame your foot, okay? And then just walk that right hand toward the up or left, right foot toward the left hand, lower the knee, and here you have it. All right, now as you're up here, soften, soften, soften that leg that's extended back, let it soften, open up the hips, and then slowly start melting down to the ground. <clears throat> Good, okay, now we're gonna push back up into our split stance. So press your torso up off the ground. Try and get that foot resettled underneath. Okay, push off, Woo. engage your core, step back. We're trying to do things the hard way, okay? All right, frame the foot, walk the left foot over to the right hand, lower the knee, extend the right leg back. All right, melt the chest forward. Open the left hip, relax the right quad. Okay, now we're gonna do just some side lines. So we're gonna get into our quads first. So I'm on my right side, reach over, grab my left ankle.
drawing my heel to my butt, trying to keep my body in a pretty neutral line. Then draw your knees together out in front. Palms are together out in front. Open up, chest to the ceiling. So open book, extend the bottom leg so it's straight out underneath. Use the right hand, press down on the left knee. All right, nicely done. Let's break the answer over to the other side. Sideline quad stretch. Try to get your, relax your legs so they can lie together in parallel. Let go of your hamstrings. Heel to butt. Good, then draw your knees together out in front, parallel to your hips, arms extended out from armpits, palms together. Exhale as you open the book to the ceiling. All right, then draw the bottom leg straight underneath. Use the left hand, press down on the top leg. Nicely done. Okay, let's warm ourselves up to a seated position. Draw your knees together. All right, nice class. Good job, guys. We'll see you next time. Have a great day. Bye.